In this video, I will show you how to link Xbox account to Steam. So let's jump straight into it. So in order to do this, the first thing you're going to want to do is open up the Xbox app on your device. So you can download this for free from the Play Store or the App Store if you're on iPhone. So once you're logged in, the first thing you're going to want to do is come and press onto your profile icon down in the bottom right hand corner to be taken to your profile page. From here, what you need to do is come up to the top right hand corner and press onto this gear icon to go into your settings. Now, if you look here underneath the account section, you can see an option for linked accounts. What you want to do is press onto linked accounts. And from here, you should see Steam at the top of the page. So what you want to do now is press the link button next to Steam. And what that's going to do is take you to a page like this where you can sign in with your account. So what you need to do is enter your account details, so your account name and password. And once you've done that, what you need to do is come down and press the blue sign in button at the bottom of the screen. So what's going to happen if you have something like an email authenticator or something like that, you're going to want to enter the codes to log into Steam. And once you've done that, it's going to log you in to a screen like this. Now it says sign into Xbox Live using your Steam account. What you need to do from here is come down to the bottom and just simply press the green sign in button. After a minute or two, what it's going to do is take you back to this screen. And as you can see, we have now linked our account and we have linked our Xbox account to Steam. So that is how to link Xbox account to Steam. With that being said, I hope this quick tutorial did help you out today. And if this did help you out, I would really appreciate it if you was to consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like, and also subscribing to the channel. And with that being said, I just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial, and I will see you in the next video.